reality, my mentality Everything changes so rapidly And I'm ready for the never ending fire Dancing with my deepest dark desires Miracle, how empirical Don't know anything quite hysterical Everything around me transpires As I fulfill my darkest desire Yo, what's going on guys? Episode 9 today I'm bringing the video on um, FNAF <laughs> Uh, so yeah, sorry I haven't been posting much recently. I missed two days. I'm such a hello darkness, my old friend. Sorry. <laughs> so we got like an audio preview of Blackbird. Um, I'm not allowed. Well, it, it's like copyrighted apparently, so like I can't show it on the video. But uh, if I remember. <laughs> Hopefully, I'll, I'll, I'll try to remember uh, to leave a link in the description so you can go listen to it yourself. But uh, I do have, like, um, what it says, like a transcript of it uh, that I can uh, read off to you guys. So, uh, yeah, let's just uh, do that. Okay, so right here I have uh, the transcript of, uh, like, what it says in the audio preview. So I'm going to read it to you, and I'll have it on the screen uh, as well, so I'll read it. It needs to be bloody. Noel sat backward on his chair. It's straight back on his ch on his chair. It's straight back between his splayed legs. In spite of the chair's cheap tan plastic and the rest of the room's less than upscale am ambience, 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 whatever, Noel managed to look cool and confident. Sam wondered when... Bleh. Sam wondered how he pulled that off so easily. Feeling like the nerd that he was, Sam tried to adjust his long legs to fit another of the cheap plastic chairs. He disagreed with Noel. Horror is not in the blood. It's the creep fa It's in the creep factor. Creep factor? N N Noel repeated. It's a technical term. Noel nodded. I, I must have dozed off when Grimly, Grimly, Grimly was talking about that. More likely, you were staring at Darla Stewart. Ooh, he, they, they got—he's got a crush on Darla Stewart, doesn't he? Yeah. Um, she's probably gonna die, isn't she? Like in Vetch. <laughs> um, let's go to Vetch. Uh, more, more likely, you were staring at Darla Stewart. You make a point, and we're not getting anywhere. <laughs> you make a point, so he's not denying it. He's like, "Yep, you're right. You make a point, and we're not getting anywhere." Sam sighed and shifted in his seat again. His legs were cramping. He was hungry, and he was pretty sure he and Noel were the only pair in the room who hadn't come up with an idea yet. Although Sam's back was to the rest of the space, he could hear the jumble of eight hushed conversations going all over the gray walled room. All right. So, okay. That is... Okay, that doesn't give us too much. It doesn't really say anything about the lore or anything. It doesn't say anything about the lore or anything, but uh, that's pretty interesting. I, um, the, hold on, I'm going to try to pull up the um, summary or the synopsis of um, Blackbird and read it out and see if we can like get a sneak peek of what's going to happen later on. I mean, that's what the synopsis is for, <laughs> I guess. Um, I'm not sure who the main character is, Noel or Sam, but I don't know. We'll see, I guess. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to go get that. Um, I'm going to go get the Blackbird, uh, synopsis and I'll be right back. Okay. So I got the Blackbird, uh, description right here. Uh, and I'm going to read that now and I'll also put it on the screen. Um, to avoid confronting an ugly truth, Noel falls prey to a monster that punishes it punishes past transgressions growing weaker by the day a nine-year-old jake looks back on the time before he was sick imagining life as if he were well again and for and forever just desperate to prove his worth to his arrogant brother and distant father toby chases victory at an arcade game with horrifying consequence consequences but in the unpredictable world of five nights at freddy's sometimes the past can take on a life of its own of of its own
Is this a description for all three of them? No faults pray to a monster that punishes past transgressions. I think that's just Blackbird. And the next one, growing weaker by the day, a nine-year-old Jake looks back on the time before he was sick, imagining life as if he were well again. I think that's number... I think that's the second story in it. And Jake, um... Jake. Jake's Jake's one of the char Jake's one of the spirits inside the Stitch Rays. And I'm pretty sure he died because he was sick. So I guess this is gonna be like the story on telling how he died and like uh, like stuff like that. And the last one, I think this is the third story. Forever desperate to prove his worth to his arrogant brother and distant father. Arrogant brother Foxy Bro. Hundred percent. Um probably at least. Um, 99%. <laughs> and Distant Father. Like, that's, that's the crying child that this is gonna be about. And it's, um... Yeah, that's the crying child that it's talking about. And, um... A Distant Father, William Afton. I mean, just like how, um, the father in Step Closer was distant to Pete and Chuck. Like... He kind of ran out on them, but like came back from time to time. Those are some of the lyrics in my "Welcome to Your to Your Biggest Mistake" song. Uh, <laughs> um, what were the lyrics again to that part? I was a dick to family because my dad was gone. He ditched us, but came back from time to time. Yeah, that's that was it. To family because my dad was gone. He ditched us, but came back from time to time. Yeah, those were the lyrics to, those were part of the, some of the lyrics to my, uh, song. Um, but yeah, that's interesting. So, Noel, Noel falls prey to a monster that punishes past transgressions. I know this is from a while ago, but I don't remember any of this, to be honest. A monster that punishes past transgressions. Huh, okay. Hmm. Interesting. Um, well, I think that's going to wrap it up for this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, if you want to hear the audio, uh, preview, the actual audio preview, uh, go down into the description. The, uh, the link should be there. If not, please just remind me with a comment and I'll be sure to add it in. Uh, but yeah, thanks guys for watching and I'll see you guys later. Bye. Peace.